Hi, my name is Dave Finley. I'm one of the product specialists here at Havis. Um, today we're going to be talking about prisoner transport inserts. What you see behind me is a medium roof, uh, long length for transit van. Now, this is an optimal setup for our 120 inch, three compartment, 60 inch tall kit. Um, some of the key features I wanted to bring up on these prisoner transport inserts is most importantly, these are made of a lightweight, durable aluminum. Now the advantage of using that aluminum is that it will not rust on you. You can also unbolt these kits and transfer them to another van. If down the road you end up um, retiring the van or if it's involved in an accident, these can always be transferred over to another van, which is a really cool feature to know that you're getting the most for your money. Um, some of the things we want to show on this kit is standard on our three compartment inserts is they all come with a slide out side step. Now this bolts up to factory locations on the and there's no drilling required very easily slides out with just putting your foot underneath so you don't have to worry about manually bringing it in and out with your hand. Um, some of the key features you're going to hear on the side compartment here, this is our side third compartment. The advantage of having a compartment like this is you can set it up so if you're transporting juveniles or you're transporting a larger individual or a disruptive out of control individual, you can keep them isolated in one compartment so they don't cause any damage or harm to anyone else in the van that you may be transporting. Some of the things you're going to see in this compartment is we have a cheek shock there in the center. Now those are shipped loose with the van. They do not need to be installed if you want to keep this just as one large single compartment, whereas now to set up for a two compartment um, vehicle. The standard on all of these is the seat belts and grab straps that's shown in the photo. There is to make sure that the occupant is always bolted in, always safe and secure while in transit. Another key feature you're seeing here is this door, the way it is kept open like this. All of our uh, prisoner transport inserts come with these door retainers. And what that does is when you're opening the door, it just locks right in and keeps that door in the open position. So if you're parked in a hill, windy day, or just have your hands full dealing with other things, you don't have to worry about that door closing on you. One of the important things we have on our door is all of them have a dual latch system, top and bottom, to make sure that this door seamlessly closes and closes securely and to make sure it will not come open no matter what's going on inside. Uh, if you want to come around to the back of the van, we're going to show you some of the cool stuff going on back there. Similar to what we showed on the third compartment is we do have the door stops as you can see top and bottom, as well as two additional compartments back here. Now these are different size compartments to create the three compartment setup. The smaller compartment on the right side here is designed mainly for females or if you are picking up just juveniles, but it is a smaller area, but you can still transport four individuals. They do have the cheek shocks installed as seen, as well as the seat belts and grab straps are standard. Um, again, you can see on the left side, this is our deeper compartment where you can transport six individuals. Uh, grab straps, seat belts, cheek shocks, all standard on these. And one of the more important things I want to show you here is the standard step that is installed on all of the rear prisoner transport inserts. Now we try and put this step at such a height where you're working so that you have one step, two step, and three step into the van, all in close proximity. So if you're dealing with prisoners that are shackled, you know that you don't have to worry about having too big of a step and they can easily get in and out with ease. Um, that's, I mean, that's a lot of the key features we're going to show on the prisoner transport. There's a lot of different options you can get with these. We do offer video systems, we do offer DVRs, rear load lights, um, power vent for air exchange systems to make sure there's constantly negative air pressure in the kit. Uh, and the list goes on from there.